Hi, this is Vicki with Condi Systems Tech Support, here today to talk about the Ricoh printers, the GX7000, the GX5050, and the GX3300. And in this video, we're going to talk about multiple paper sizes and how to tell the printer what size paper is in each individual tray. If you have auto tray select selected from your printer, it has the ability to know exactly what size is in each tray. I'm going to walk you through that now and show you how to do it from the menu. All right, so we're going to assign a paper tray. We've got three trays. We've got the bypass tray. We have tray one and we have tray two. And we're going to first uh, press your menu key. We're going to arrow down one time. You're going to see paper input. Press your enter key. You're going to see tray paper size. You're going to press your enter key. This is relating to tray one. So we are going to select it by pressing the enter key. And we're going to assign tray one to uh, auto, uh, auto tray select using the 8.5 by 11 paper size, which is the letter. So to select 8.5 by 11, you have to have the asterisk beside it. So that means it's selected. If it's not selected uh, with an asterisk, you'd press the enter key and the asterisk would appear. So that's selecting tray one. Now we're going to go down to tray two. So we're going to arrow down to tray two. We're going to press the enter key. And we're going to choose uh, the 11 by 17. So we want to make sure that we arrow down or up to find 11 by 17. We're going to press the enter, the enter key to make the asterisk appear. That means that 11 by 17 is selected. Remember that you can print up to an 11 by 17 in tray one or two. So now we're going to escape out one time. We're going to arrow down one time, and we're going to choose the bypass tray. Now the bypass tray will print up to a 13 by 19 paper size or smaller. So in this bypass tray, we're going to press the enter to select a paper size. I have mug paper selected so that I can print mug paper from this uh, bypass tray. But you can select up to a 13 by 19. So in order to select the mug paper size, you need to know your dimensions. If those dimensions are not in there, you can also arrow down and find a custom paper size in your list. And you can assign a custom paper size this way. But I've already got a uh, mug paper selected, so I'm going to arrow back up to find my mug paper. And I'm going to press Enter. And that's going to put the asterisk by it, and it's going to go back to bypass tray. Now I have all three tray sources uh, assigned a paper size so that now when I go to print from um, from the PC or Mac it's going to know exactly what tray to pull from. So escape all the way back out to you see ready and your printer's back online. Okay so we've talked about assigning multiple tray sources for paper sizes in auto tray select with the Rico printers GX7000, 3300 and the GX5050. If you have any questions about how to assign paper sizes, you can call us here at Condi Systems. Anyone in the tech support department should be able to help you or walk you through setting up your, your tray sources. Again, this is Vicki with Condi Systems Tech Support. Thank you for your time.